Hi, I'm Steve Nicolaret. This is Baseball School from the Ground Up. In this segment, we just want to conclude our final thoughts on, uh, on rundowns. So, uh, number one, the back guy in a rundown, his job is to get his feet around, ready to throw the ball a full 85 feet to, uh, to the forward base. Or, if the runner isn't running away from him, his job is to run as hard as he can at the runner in order to get the runner to start moving away from him. Um, number two, we throw darts. We don't, uh, we don't wind up and stop and set our feet and throw. We teach the kids to throw darts in the rundown. Number three, if you're going to receive the ball in a rundown, we always have our kids break down slightly, just in case the throw isn't, uh, isn't perfect. Uh, number four, always make sure that the kids don't cross the stream when they throw. What's that mean? Uh, let's suppose the third baseman receives the ball from the pitcher when we pick off a guy between third and home. The catcher's job is to make sure he understands whether the third baseman is on the fair side of third base or the foul side of third base. Whatever side the third baseman is on, the catcher must also be on that side. Um, and finally, uh, just remember this. If the second guy on the forward side gets into a rundown, suppose we're between third and home, uh, and the pitcher has to step into the rundown, he will have already sharpened up the distance. He will have already been sharpening the noose from home plate down towards third base.